Hello and welcome to a rather weird survival map in Day of Billions. This is a 900% difficulty, so max difficulty map, provided by one of my viewers. And we are on the Caustic Lands, but we do have some strange map generation going on here. If you take a look at the minimap, you can see that all the mutants and all the giants are in the northwest. That usually does mean that all the rest of the map isn't populated by zombies. And it can also mean two things that either that area is not accessible for us at all, or the second option I've encountered so far is that there is a small path, but it is blocked by the Doomtown and then the map generation does think that area isn't accessible. Whatever the reason, this means we do have to face a lot of mutants when we try to expand past our initial starting area. And not only does awaits. it contain all the mutants and giants there, seems good, seems the Doomtown has to fit in that area as well. So this can make for a rather interesting start, where you have to juggle defending the Doomtown with not making too much noise and preparing to pull multiple mutants at once. Otherwise, the normal survival map rules apply. We have to survive for 80 days with the final wave of zombies appearing at day 93. And as always, I hope you enjoy the run. Steal yourself. We are building an army. Sure, let's get a sniper making more noise. This Newton's near mic can never go bad. Maybe I'll put the wood workshop here then. So somewhere here, here, wood workshop, farm. Boris farm, farm. Okay, we're pulling a lot from up there. Maybe I found the Doomtown already? Okay. Roger that. No, 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 no. Oh, Kill this one. Easy. Okay, well. That's one way to start the map, I guess. Okay. Oh. Maybe you guys can stop shooting here, actually. I, I assume they're pulling the Doomtown from somewhere here. So if you could just stop, maybe you guys go down there. Thank you. Or are trying to kill you since... Oh, when did the game come out? Which year? Yeah, it looks like everything is top left. Uh, we'll have to see if the map generation only allowed top left or if the Doomtown blocked the path towards the rest or something. Oh, there's iron down here. That's nice though. Rich attacked. Thanks for the prime. Appreciate it. So, I mean, I don't know where the Doomtown is, but I assume it's here. So we'll have to see um, how far I can go there. There's a shocking tower towards it. Well, if it is toward it. Uh, if I build here, I can still get the... Uh, Hunter workshop there. Not the hunter workshop, the wood workshop. I was thinking of putting another um, hunter cottage here, but I can't because this one's too close. Yes. Sniper, try to incoming in 3, 2, 1, no. Well, it nearly killed me already. I don't know if the soldier pulled too much or the sniper, but yeah. A crunchy weasel. Here, okay. yeah, let's put soldier and sniper as far to the south as we can so they don't pull as much from the top there. All the way down here, so, yeah. There's already veteran. And once I have energy, I can get the woodwork drop and we can start farming. Is this an impossible map or just an interesting? We'll have to see. At currently, I think it's more an interesting map. Um, but there's a lot of mutants there. Um, so if we pull them all like at the worst time, like if you always pull all of them at the same time, depending how the layout is, it might... Oh, okay, the doom tone is here. It might also fall into impossible category. But currently, I think it's more interesting than um, possible. Well, this is kind of awkward here to defend then, okay. But 
you know, it uh, works with the theory that the Doomtown is up here because the sniper and soldier pulled it all. There's a nice shocking tower actually towards it, I gotta say. That is tempting. There's a lot of mutants we'd have to kill with that though, but it is, you know, that could be pretty fun. The map command is showing an old map. The map command only works with custom maps, and this is a survival map. Survival maps are always on the Discord. Custom maps are on the workshop. So the map command links to the workshop. For survival maps, you just have to join the Discord and find it there. I don't want to shoot the building, but I do want to clear a bit more here. The stranger nearly died too. And there's gold to pick up here. But I kind of want to farm tech first. Okay, I need the veteran ranger at this place. Like there's no hiding space or anything. Farming. There was one stray zombie here. So this is all cleared. I think I saw a here initially, but I, I guess I built too close. But if we get one here. It would have impeded with this anyway, so we'll get another one later here or something. Not that I need a sawmill just yet. Ooh, there's free energy too. Radar or woo. It does look like a yeah, very small base we're gonna have in the end. Ooh, that gold quarry could be interesting too. So we're getting at least we're getting iron here too, and then some gold. Okay, farming isn't as good as I hoped, and we're pulling a ton here. Too. Pick up that gold now. You read my mind. Our soldiers are in trouble. And I do want to expand over towards here too. We can get the quarries maybe relatively early. And sniper is still making too much noise. Okay, and I think I want another quarry or two to get a bit more stuff. Wondering if I want to defend first wave with ballista or traps. Because if it comes through here, it's kind of awkward, I guess. But then again, building the ballistas towards the Doomtown is early. Like it's also way more resource invested. I guess we'll do traps as usual. Yeah, I could get an early soldier. I also don't know where I'm going to build. Maybe I'll build a warehouse here. That might not be bad. Something like 
I'm gonna build two scratching posts or well, I guess it's a wall more here than a scratching post. Just to be safe there. The warehouse here. Um, I gotta be careful not to accidentally repair this shocking down, but I kind of want to keep it. I kind of want to keep it. This one down here seems less useful though, so I might destroy this one for resources. And then, I guess cottage tech. What? Are you sure? Attention. Okay. Building. You are going to pay me for this, right? Over here, I want to grab that energy too. Gotcha. Attention. Try not to get overrun now. Our forces are in danger. This better be good. Yeah. Straight to the heart. Attention. Building completed. Built this here. Yeah. Hmm. Built this here. I guess we could get this here. I guess we get overall more if I do it. Yes. It'll take a bit longer to get the second um, corridor. Let's keep it. Let's upset the mutie. <laughs> well, the hope is to have a bunch of snipers here, and then they can take care of mutants we pull while the shocking tower kills the doom tower. Or the zombies from there. I don't know if we can get enough workers out for that, but that's kind of the plan for now. We'll expand a bit more down here. Oh, it was further down here. Like, I thought this would go up here right away. Kind of a weird layout. I think the soldier and sniper are pulling stuff up here still too. Gotcha. Order, sir. Well, hey, well, more iron. Right. Apparently we have more than enough iron. I would have liked a bit more stone income here eventually. Right. But that's okay. I guess I should research the traps now. What do you want now? Okay. Yeah. Building complete. Roger that. Mm. Pull too much here too. A colony. Do I want colony. more rangers? A colony who needs a mayor, that's who. I guess. It'll be a bit safer. I kinda want the stone walls though when we do the shocking tower pull here, but maybe we can tech for that. Traps. I can range her towards the Doom Town. This better be good. My rifle is ready. Okay. You are gonna and then those guys can clear a bit here. Yeah. Pretty interesting. Homie oh, shield. Yeah, it like it frees up. Like I can keep the ranger down here. I was thinking of pulling her up here. Doom Town side is a bit safe, or we have an extra ranger for kiting. Like it is safer having. I think those extra rangers. We want the Tesla tower here though, so we can build some traps for kiting. Oh, it is coming straight through here. Well, I guess we'll build a highway for the Doomtown zombies. At your service. Okay. 
Okay, roger that. Yes. Our forces are in danger. And then do not press all repair. Do not press all repair. Do not press all repair. Okay, let's press all repair. Oh, danger down. We don't stand too close. We'll just shoot the uh, Doom Town. I mean, I'm running low on food places, actually, too. All the west doesn't seem like very, um, farmlandy. Can still get some hunter cottages here too. Or sawmill, I guess. Well, or both. Okay. Well, that's the first wave. Get that free energy over here. We could also do some fishing, that's also true, yeah. Um, maybe I don't want to use the soldier and sniper here more. There is a mutant over here, actually. Maybe you just stay back here now. Should get the other um, gold quarry here, though. Kind of the reason we pushed down there. This here and this one here. I guess that's what block and they can't build there anyway, so. Thinking if I want to build an energy um here. That would def then decide like where we build the next fishing here. I'll build it here and leave the option open. I'm not building too much um, energy up there either. Not seeing this map in the channel. It's definitely in the map files channel. I downloaded it there like. An hour ago. Uh, it's not too old in there. But I, yeah. And also, you remind me after stream, I can also link it again. The, like map discussion channel or something. here uh let's actually get market tech we'll build a market here i guess i could build more housing down here actually. not gonna be amazing but not like i have too many places to work with anyway Yeah, I don't know how far I want to push you anyway. Um, 
like we are getting somewhat closish to mutants, right? And even even rangers can pull them, so. Ooh, nice. We got the market. So let's do that. Here. Um, I mean, I could tank for the bank already, maybe? Because again, like, I'm not gonna get... Yeah, I guess I'm kind of running out of food. Maybe I should claim this food here we can maybe get another farm here i mean market will give us some too i'll probably build this over here and then we can get one on the other side and then one over here This one here, and this one has to be down here. So we skip one gold tile there. That's okay. Yeah, I'll build the energy here. for this too. Everything needs energy. How do we build this here? Over here and here. We need, can build more energy here. This question kind of is how fast do I take for the bank right now? So let's go. Okay, and then we also need um, Ballista attack. So next goal take is Ballista attack, and then we start building... Ooh, it's going to be hard getting enough Ballistas here for the Doomtown, actually. Since we can't build here, and this is blocking us a bit too. Yeah, it's going to be awkward. I guess Ballista here, 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 and then maybe we can sneak one in up there? Yeah, I'm, mutants is Project Hope, I guess, as always. Okay, I guess I want to clear a few more of those zombies then. We can. I guess I should build a warehouse actually for this territory here too. Either down here or up here, but I, I guess multiple warehouses is good. So we maybe we'll build one warehouse down here too. We'll cover those quarries and the oil, and then we'll later build one another one here again. Change the house address from the command center if your food is. I'm not sure what you mean. Can you describe it differently, maybe? What? Gotcha. He got lost in the translation. Like, move this housing here for food, you mean? Um, I could that, but I don't really have a lot of other housing areas, right? Like, this isn't enough down here either. Like, this is my best housing area. But yeah, in an emergency, we destroy some stuff here and get some food. Might be able to... ...reason some other stuff eventually. 
Okay, so we, we're killing this building because, yeah, this will hit that. Hey, this is too close then. Newton can smell food. It's walking slowly closer. <laughs> well, we're probably gonna kill, try to kill this one first, right? We'll build a bunch of snipers and then put them here. Um, okay. From the south. Yes, that could come here, which is kind of... Well, it might come also through here. I guess this is probably shorter than going down here, right? If I build this one here, it'll shoot building on the other side. It'll shoot this building. I mean, it's kind of awkward either way. Putting that building, okay. And that, yeah, that one mutant is just way too close. Mister down here just in case something splits. I mean, I am kind of assuming this goes up until here and then the shortest path is here. But if this stops exactly here, then I guess they could come down here. So, yeah, either way, it could be awkward. Uh, I didn't research the bank yet. I mean, if uh, if they do come here, I do at least need a second ballista since I don't have traps ready yet. Yes. Not what I wanted to do. Okay. Well, actually, this is going forward. So. Oh, apparently there's harpies. Okay. I mean, this could also be closed, I guess, technically. Then they would again come down here. <laughs> Damn it. I don't know where the wave comes from. And I don't like it. Also, I really need to not um, repair that shocking tower by accident. Up here, Z still seems more like them. Okay, it is coming here. Just need 10 more ballistas and you're fine. Well, wow. nothing. Nothing big then that we still need. Good. Let's get the bank. Out of energy. That. Uh, sniper tech. Bone housing. And then, yeah, I guess prep. Kind of thinking about building that one extra ballista down here. It'll shoot this building, which, I mean, I guess I'm kind of okay with. We'll cover this side a bit more, too. That's a, that's a good idea. Here, find this. Uh, 
Switch to power blends. Oh, I never got my second quarry, actually. Uh -huh. Only two stone. I guess it's not a lot. Something, though. Pick up this stone here. So I do need soldier centers and stone housing now. Yeah, follow the, the link for the health bar, permanent health bars. I like a valuable sawmill down here. I'm not sure. I should, however, go in here. Definitely can get another energy mill there. Can I get a sawmill here and one here? The so power plants isn't too bad. Put this here. And probably soldier center somewhere here. Which I really should start building now. Once I have energy so we get the snipers up. Need a new <laughs> keyboard. Well you can also use like um, auto hotkey or something to always just press alt. Um, or whatever you bind it to. Maybe not all, because if you press a 4 for flat mode or something, that would be not ideal. But, yeah. That's just um, using... Uh, using the uh, numpad trick just means you don't need any external programs or anything. Which is kind of neat. Still waiting for the energy. I mean, I kind of would have liked to build a market and a bank here and, like, do a second housing area here. But where do we build soldier centers then, right? And I do need snipers. Unfortunately. Okay, stone walls. Well, I have no workers. <laughs> uh, we can pick up the stone from the Doom Town, I guess. Here we go again. You order, you pay. Yeah, if... And I guess I could get a quarry here. It's a bit risky, but it would give us more stone too. Which I could really kind of use. No mutants have been pulled yet, no. If we, already, we pulled a mutant, I'd already be dead. Oh, I was at the warehouse somewhere here, but yeah. Well, we could still build it later here. Okay, sniper production is a go. Fishing here. Another one here. Oh no, this. Uh, I guess I could build it here. Will give me one stone. But then I block pathing. Eh. Build it here. Okay. I don't want to block pathing just yet. Okay, I researched stone walls. Shocking tower research too. Yeah, I think we'll kill this mutant and then we'll do like snipers and towers, repair the shocking tower here and pray <laughs> action. But I want to get rid of this one first, like he's too close, so we're going to make noise down here.
How good of a storm would we get here for? Yeah. I mean, I, I guess I should make sure there is a path here, but I think there is a path. Like, it just looks open. Because if we make noise here and this would be closed and then he comes here, <laughs> would be one way to die, I guess. Well, I guess we get the bonus soldiers. Yeah, I don't want to wait much longer, to be honest. Because he's so close, I'm kind of scared. Maybe we try to do this before the wave. I'm close. Okay, let's build another ballista. Second wall. In the tower finish, we populate them or something. It's coming from the east, so I still have a bit of time in that regard, I guess. The other mutant up here. Come on, get that shocking tower up and running. Hold the line until then. Hold the line. Next mutant. That's not good. Well, the next two mutants, I guess. Don't line. <laughs> not going ideally. If he kills the shocking tower, I'm in, in real trouble. Okay. Well, a bunch of mutants down. Basically just buying time all the time until the shocking tower can shoot again. Like, that's the, the, the whole strategy here right now. Ooh. But it's over here is dying too. I pull him away from the ballista a bit. Okay, I got a repair off, nice. Run for your life, soldier. 
Everything is going um, according to plan. Somehow. Okay, this ballista will probably die again, but that's okay. Might still be best to claim this first before we kill the Doomtown, like there's some farming there to be going. Killing the Doomtown will take a while. The is under attack. Was epic? Well, that went... <laughs> I mean, that was probably as close as it could get without dying. There's still a bunch of chubbies and everything coming here all the time. So I'll, I want to leave some snipers here, I think. But yeah, okay, I don't need that many towers down here anymore. Enemy's too close. I mean, a lot of waves will come here. I guess I could keep the shocking tower in for now, even though it's kind of a drain on my energy resources. But. Got rid of the bombs. Yeah, most bombs died, but they kind of saved the colony, so. They were kind of important. They tanked long enough for the shocking tower to um, get operational and then kited for a while to keep it going. So, thank you, Bobs. Okay, we'll expand from down here and then. Find probably something to block off here and then go for the Doom Tone, I think. But yeah, I'm out of food, so. They serve their purpose. <laughs> well, that's what you use then. But yes. Map 80% cleared. Well. <laughs> close to it, I guess. I mean, I thought I would die there too when the mutant came. I thought I was dead. Not gonna lie. That looked pretty crim. I mean, I still gotta be a bit careful. Like, there's still a bunch of mutants up there. I don't have that many snipers either. Get rid of that now. Get the second ori as well. And enough workers. We don't need these towers here, right? Wait, is this closed here or not? Actually, I didn't see that mini path. Okay, this. Good, good. One of the mutants. Uh, was the second one coming? Look at the path he's taking, though. Like, is this here the only entry point here? Like that mini path? That's why that mutant down up here, when you he heard the noise. Probably heard the noise here, went from there too, and not here. That was shorter. Okay, well, I guess we built the uh, final wave defenses right here. Yep, this is closed. Well, actually, I don't see everything here yet. Oh, maybe there's a connection here, but then it's still longer to walk through there. Still do need more stone. Yeah, there's a connection here. So if the wave is really big, it could overflow, I guess, but otherwise it shouldn't. Bullseye. 
Are all soldier bobs? Or is it only the starting one? Uh, usually the first one, but I guess it kind of went into all, all soldiers are bobs. So. At least that's how I thought always it's like the first one it's supposed to be. With that, we can, uh, I guess, start working on the Doomtown a bit. I could move the soldier centers and build like a market and bank here too. And I guess get a bit more housing there. Not a lot. Then again, I guess if we kill the Doomtown, we just build housing there. Giant all has go outside the map. Oh yeah, true. These are... Yes, tell me what to kill. Uh, this up here is so hard to see, but I think it's a one-tile joke. Yeah, this is a one-tile joke. So yeah, the giant has to go outside to get to me. Just in case, I'll build one ballista here, though. And wall it. I'll keep the shocking tower here at least until the next wave. I mean, we don't really need a shocking tower for that. But also in case we pull a mutant and pull too much. And then after that, we probably push out here. I'll move the soldier centers. This is gonna be a sad <laughs> housing area too, but you know, it's the uh, and then the third housing area potentially here. Don't and crowd sauce by the warehouse. Oh yeah, it's true. That's still there. Thanks. Really forgot about that one. From the west, so it'll come here. Yeah, probably for final wave, I'll build a bit more walls here than two. Yeah, I, I guess waves will always get pushed in here, actually. Let's actually make this thicker. Just in case. It's a really nice choke point. And uh, I just will tank a bit. Do I have oil actually? Yeah, there's one oil. Yeah, we might not get a lot of oil in this map actually. That might be a thing. This is one tile here, yeah. I shouldn't be able to get through there. I do have a bit of space here, but not too much. I mean, you know, I was thinking building the foundry there. To be perfectly honest. Oh. Yeah, once I have energy, we rebuild the soldier centers. 
Because now I'm, I can't dump my gold into anything right now. Back to one more. I'm sure it's the original one, right? Wasted space here too, I guess. Oh well. Okay. All the stone we can here. Oh, I don't need this anymore either. Ooh. Have a nice summer. This is getting pretty open, I'll have to see where I want to expand here. And I do need more stone. Thankfully the Doomtown is providing some of it. Since I won't get a lot of oil, I guess I could consider an oil wonder. From the Doomtown oil, but... Yeah, I don't know. Can a zombie apocalypse be a sniper where you will have higher survival rank? <laughs> nah, be a citizen. They're invulnerable to zombies. They can even walk through them. Apparently. I mean, this is great farmland, but it's also like the ideal housing area. I gotta say. Well, this would have been a good sawmill position too. I guess I could put this one here and move this to here. And Hunter Cottage. But you also randomly disappear. <laughs> Fair enough. I'm still undecided if I want to build housing or farming here, because we probably won't get a lot of space in total. I don't want to wait too long with building more housing. But it looks like we might be able to get housing over there. For Titan salary, sure. Search oil. over here. On your orders. Come on. 
Just spread too thin now, going everywhere. Don't need the shocking tower anymore. Area here is going further over here than I thought it would. Oh wait, I have two oils actually. Oh, cool. I mean, I don't want to block pathing. Oh no. Hold you down. Yes. It's coming from the east. Okay, there's a mutant here. Now what happens when you're spread too thinly? They come in actually. Like, is this? Oh, this is closed. Okay. okay. Reading the stone quarries first because they're the most important ones right now, and then I'll upgrade all the quarries. Can we get a new bomb? <laughs> wow. But they're unique. Can't replace them. Maybe I'll build a warehouse here. energy still. Something to pick up here. Engineering center. Well, if I start building other units, I probably don't need this many sniper production. At least for now. It's here. Oh. Tesla Tower's in the way. Here now. Are being 
Get that housing area going. And I can research Titans too. Maybe I do need um, advanced mills actually too, eventually. Because we are kind of limited in space on this map. I mean, I guess maybe I should have built Market Bank here and then made the housing area bigger. Maybe I would have been better. Oh well. Do need more food now, though. Energy. The mighty Titan is here. Sniper is ready. A great machine for a great man. Indeed. Excuse me. I do need um I guess better iron quarries too. I think most of my quarries are upgraded though, right? Yeah. Oh wait, I forgot to build one down here. Uh huh. Look at that. Okay, this looks like an entry point where the waves come in. There is some oil, but yeah, we can build some defenses there and then go from there. Also a giant up there. Okay, edge of the map. We pull the mutants. A wave coming from the east. That's where we're expanding. It should be fine. It's gonna be a bit awkward defending there, I guess. Unless we defend behind the stone, but I kind of want the stone, so... Let's get the stone. 
Very good. Yes, tell me what to kill. Hello. Let's go. Can we, can we shoot the giant? Yes, maybe. Thank you. Wait, is that east wave going south and then coming from the west? Like that east? Or? Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? It's a weird viewer map or a weird viewer map? It's a weird viewer map, obviously. I mean, it could technically split too, but the skull is down here all the way, so I guess it's not coming up here at all. Okay. Pocket two. Claim more of the map then. Let's go. Wait, now the skull is in the middle of my base, so I guess there's something is coming up here. A steadfast supporter. You know, I'm kind of curious on how the path there looks. Let's actually get the oil wonder first, because I have two oil income. <laughs> so yeah, if I want to get it, I have to get it first. Yes. I have to buy a lot of oil. Look at this beautiful choke point here though. Wait, is this the only entrance here, or is there some of it open there too? Well, that wasn't ideal. Ah, no, it's open here too. Okay. Defended. I think I claimed all the oil. I mean, I didn't see too many. The three oils. Well, there's one more over here that we can still get. Hello. And we have it all. And we'll do a thin wall here so we, you know, get a bit more space to play with. Wait, that one giant from down here ran up? Oh, interesting. Oh, maybe we can go south from here. Like, we can't expand there, but maybe we can clear. Attention. 
Any more oil to pick up? No. Morning, sir. Wait, does this here? Oh, this is one tile short. Let's fix that. This is a 900% map, but I mean, there's a lot less zombies in the map because there's only a quarter map. <laughs> so, but technically, it's 900%, yes. The special one. like towers here that you can shoot over. Although spitters might hit that. Or maybe we can go through there towards Doom Town. Ah, uh, not Doom Town, like zombies. Is all my housing upgraded? I guess we built more here. Stone with more gold, we can build an oil under. Also, aim the oil here. It's gonna be a big exposed, but actually, not much will come up here, right? should warehouse this up here too. first. Troops are chasing somewhere. Well, let's put the Titans up north then. Vision wonderful science. Yeah, we'll get more wonders in a second. So open this up and see if the snipers can go further south here. Just wanted to get the oil wonder first and then go from there. Got oil near the lake? I did? I don't see it. Oh, this one here. Oh, yeah, I didn't. Oh. I guess I didn't have to resist this. Oh, wait. Oh, this is split again. I guess. Maybe don't run outside yet, then, snipers. I guess I'm buying the stone and stuff. I think the holder feels wrong. Like it would still be better to get like a food wonder and stuff, but let's take a look at the map. Wait, not all my quarries upgraded either yet. Let's well, just sloppy. Get more iron income, which I kind of do need now too. Okay, so 
I don't know if it's coming here. Now we got oil. Okay, quarries are upgraded. Wait, can I get a quarry here actually? Like for a bit more iron? After the wave, obviously. Let's get some stone here, I guess. Oh, missing one tile. The waves will attack here, so it's not ideal, I guess, but... Okay, and then we'll get the food wonder after the beholder. And I probably should... Wait, which market and bank is weaker? This one or this one? I probably should move one of them. Thirty-five. Thirty-four. Oh, thirty-seven here. But it doesn't reach them all. It doesn't reach the ones down here. Making this actually slightly weaker, I think. Get some fishing here. Yeah. I mean, I can't build more without destroying stuff, at least. Okay, well, we're waiting for some resources and then we can. Oh, yeah, I wanted to check if we can um, go south here. Hunter cottages. I mean, there's not really a lot of places for that here. We did a pretty decent job at drop at building stuff this time. I mean, I c we can build them in between here, I guess. We can also still get advanced um, farms eventually, but for now I'm getting the food wonder. Why do I only have 13 stone income? Is my stone income that bad? I really wanted to build the other one here. These. I guess the... I mean, the wonder is taking some, but... Well, it's taking 20. I guess it's taking a lot. <laughs> Maybe the oil wonder wasn't the best idea. Oh, we can go south here? I'm not sure they'll be able to come back, but... I don't know if I can go for now. Oh. One sniper made it. Oh, okay, it's dead end here anyway. Oh my. A timely reappearance. The dungeon. You keep the pocket safe. Good morning, sir. Reader. Thanks for the six months. Okay, we got full map vision. Yeah, the mountain goes all the way up here. This is all the territory we are missing. Ooh. Now that's a pocket. That's a real pocket. The mighty Titan is here. Not a real pocket here. Interesting. Like even if this was open, you wouldn't be able to get that great area down here. <laughs> would all be blocked by this mega mountain range. Okay, well let's get the Food wonder. Oh, 
was really hoping it would fit there. Yeah, there are no roamers on the rest of the map. So there's uh, the map generation only spawns zombies in places that are reachable. And since we can't reach this area, the map generation doesn't spawn zombies here. It also doesn't spawn um, like any quarry positions or oil. Like none of these things are here, right? They're all missing because the map decides that it's unreachable, which it is. So it doesn't spawn anything there. No, you can't, your energy can't go outside of um, map range. And it doesn't go over mountains either. So you can't reach these areas for building. Um. Research the advanced farms. Create some some extra mills. There, no, there, I don't know which ones you mean blocked. Like up here. These ones I didn't send anywhere. Like the Titan should be able to have this. I mean, the hard part of the map is the beginning, obviously. Where all the mutants and giants and the Doom Town are all in the same area. And then you pull. want to pull one specific one and pull another one by accident. And suddenly you have mutants and the Doom Town coming in a place you didn't fully prepare for it. And then build a shock, repair a shocking tower and try to buy time. That's the hard part. Sure, if you, if you ignore that, then I guess it's an easy map. <laughs> like, we've played worse maps, yes, but I wouldn't call this an easy map. Just because you're done early. For the oil window, but how am I going to build all my oil stuff then? Oh, interesting. Some of it split again. Not a lot this time. Pulling energy mono? Um, I should still get that too, yeah. I need some stone and iron for that. Or we'll just buy some of that too. Maybe I'll build it here, like I have some destroyed stuff there anyway. For outside the visible map boundary, is the terrain defined? I think usually it's it ends pretty pretty much there. Like the zombies, I mean, seem to always like come in right after these places, right? Like here, it ends right here. They're running past it. But spider waves can always reach you, at least. Titan is here. The sniper's out there is a wall. Oh, this one here. Yeah, I guess it. Yeah, thanks. That's true. Like, there's still pathing, but I thought you meant complete pathing block. Yes, it uh, blocks it a bit there. You use macro to buy stuff? Nope. I buy manually. I guess we keep you inside them. The mighty Titan is here. They are attacking the colony defenses. Uh, 
Let's put this somewhere here. So, so still gonna build the victorious. Oh. I mean, I only need to destroy like one. It's okay. And do you click so fast? I don't think I click so fast. Uh, for market, what you can do, you can click left and right mouse click at this, um, both to buy. Like, this would be just left. Wait, usually it works. And yeah, the, select all the markets who you buy three times at a time. Wait, you were supposed to stay here. Guard the entrance. A steadfast supporter. Okay, old spire coming soon. Nish. Attention. Building completed. Attention. Repair the iron mine north. I did not. Good point. Didn't have to let it get infected in the first place. Like, that's the real issue. Tor is still researching. Again, so the map generation, like, the zombies get spawned at the end, I think at least. Like, I don't know exactly how it works, but um, as far as I know, the zombies get spawned at the end of the map generation. And it basically checks, um, is there, is an area reachable? And then it spawns zombies in there, right? Like, otherwise the map generation would spawn zombies in an area like this too. And, um, well, all these places here are not reachable for me, right? Like, reachable from your command center, that's what I mean. Like, we can't reach this, so no zombies can spawn here. And then the same reason why there's no iron, no gold, no stone, no oil in any of these places. Because the map generation deems it inaccessible. Now, in this case, it is actually inaccessible. Um, we've had maps where, like, the Doomtown would block like this exit and then you could still walk south but since the doomtown blocked it the uh, like if there's a building in here and you can't walk through that then the map can also can considers that inaccessible so that can also um cause issues Victorious. Yo. Well, they're trying to walk through the forest here. Oh, that. Oh. I did chase command and then this one sniper walked up here again. And just died. Uh, yeah. Execute attack. Good idea, too. That's what I meant. Like, if the wave is too big, then they're gonna flow over here. So that's why I wanted the wall and the tower there at least. Oh, this is at a random wave. It's okay. You can see the random waves really nicely on this map. <laughs> Where they're coming and how much is coming. Beautiful.
can you quit glitch one snap? Uh, you could glitch the unit through here, yeah, you could do that if you wanted to. Finish my housing and then we can build defenses. It's rare that you build all wonders on a 9% map, you're spoiling us. Yes. Hey, lately I've built uh, Blade Challenge maps. I didn't build all the wonders there. This is a very relaxing map after the beginning, though. I did think I would die at that one point, though. So. This is, um. Nice surprise. Do I still have unupgraded mills too? Yes. Missed the option to speed up. Yeah, sometimes it would be nice. I mean, I think in most maps it doesn't matter, but there are a few where it would be nice. Like, if you want to speed up, you're usually playing on a too low difficulty. <laughs> but... I mean, maybe you overestimated how my hard map is, or some custom maps, it would be really nice, too. But I would appreciate a speed-up button. MVP is the Shocking Tower? Yeah, that, I mean, that was an amazingly placed Shocking Tower, especially since the zombies can't destroy the iron walls, right? Like, otherwise he would have died before he even got one shot off. That definitely was... What's the MVP? Or spawn wave. So, the, I mean, what you can do, like, there's a custom map. A kind gesture. Titan is here. Um, thank you. EHKW for gifting us up. I appreciate that. Um, there is a custom map called Fifth. Uh, no, speedruns. Um, made by chaps where you can call waves earlier and it basically recreated all the survival maps I think he did all the survival maps maybe he only did caustic I, I'm not sure anymore no he did all the ones I did them on different ones and basically you, what you can do on this map is you can call waves earlier and then the goal of the map is to beat it as fast as possible And if you don't call the waves early, they just come at normal times. I've uh, done a bunch of those runs too. That was a pretty, pretty good idea what he did there. We playing desert with doubles. I haven't done desert with double zombies yet. No. Otherwise, double zombies would be pretty brutal, to be honest. Um, mostly for the double mutants. I mean, everything else would be pretty brutal too, but double mutants on desert would be a pain. Because the one advantage desert has over Caustic is that usually there's like one side where there's no mutant that you can expand to. And you kind of need that because you need to get some extra food. Wait, did I build all the wonders? I'm... Wait, no, I forgot the veteran wonder. Oh no. Is there room for a couple of mills? Yeah, there's room here. I could also build a power plant. Better than a mill. A farm. Probably would have done it the other way around, but... <laughs> Uh, what? Oh yeah, I wanted the veteran one now. Day 73 is final wave, yes. On normal, well, on 80 day survival maps. Day 73 is final wave. What about three times mutants? Yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> I mean, people have requested the uh, extra mutants maps. Like, we had the giant map where we had extra giants. Maybe at some point I'll do the extra new map. I don't think it's honestly 
very interesting or very fun, but it has been requested a lot. But maybe one day. I might do the split wave challenge first, though. So, uh, basically, the same as double wave map, but um, all the waves don't come from the same direction anymore. The title for YouTube, A Shocking Defense. Sorry if you already saw it. I saw the Shocking Defense, but I didn't see it as a title suggestion. That's actually... I like it. A terrible pun. Yeah, maybe I'll use that. I remember. What are your plans for the maps? Well, I want to play your double, your split wave maps, right? Um, I want to see if the... I mean, I have a few custom maps I want to try. Trying to find some older ones that aren't just a billion giants. <laughs> uh, there's a couple of fewer maps I have my eyes still on. Like the fewer map with only one wood income at the start. I definitely wanted to play that. Maybe another impossible map soonish. The mighty Titan is here. We had the person on Discord who's, who said he had um, has the modding stuff going on. I was hoping he maybe can mod campaign. I know he had his eyes set on the survival increased difficulty. Maybe I'll try those too. Um, but I kind of want to play a campaign run with more zombies. If I can. It does kind of sound like fun. Uh, some of Korn's maps are on the workshop, like the, the Harpy Den, uh, the Split Wave one uh, that I haven't played yet is on the workshop. Some of the extra, like the double zombie ones, are on the Discord. But he linked them all on the Discord anyway, so you can just always... Um, yeah, I think I followed Korn now too on, on the Steam Workshop, so I always see them right away. I will pass with Double the Zombie. The mighty Titan is here. So if, if it is possible for someone to make a double... I, mean, I still have to build my wonder... Uh, double Zombie campaign maps. I don't know if we can play them all. Like, there is still, like... um. The final map just has too many zombies already, so it might be too laggy to actually do that. Uh, stuff like Lowlands and Narrow Pass, I don't know how they would go. <laughs> but they would be pretty brutal to play. But they shouldn't be too laggy, I think. At least they would have that. Just sort of an idea after the first wave, all old waves repeat plus new one. That could be neat. Head to the map editor and make it. Actually build walls here now. And then... Uh I mean, most things will either come here or here, anyway. Oh, look at that. It was too hard for them to move. I don't think too much will come in these places, but I guess I could put a few titans there, too. But yeah, if you have cool maps that you found or made yourself, like either, either one works. 
Uh, feel free to post them on the Discord. That's usually the place I see the maps most likely. And play them. What about a map where you can only use mutants as a unit and get buffs to them? Um, I mean, I had some mutant maps. Like custom maps. I don't remember what they were called. Well, some from the... There was the uh, person who made the numbered map series. The <laughs> they always said... The name was always just A and then the number A1, A17 or something. Or a map 17 or something something like that he made um different units like the focus on of each map and then i think we had one map maker who went like made a tenatos map a titan map a mutant map a lucifer map i don't remember the names though anymore it's been a while you played yeah yep 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 yep, yep. I mean, yeah, I guess we just wait for the final wave. I usually, I mean, if you search my channel, like YouTube channel for mutants, it probably should show up um, some of those maps. Because I usually put it in the tags what unit I, is like the focus of the map. Not always, I sometimes forget. But in general, um, probably should show up some of them at least. Oh yeah, there's the testing mutants map where I only build mutants as my oil units on 9%. Mutant evolution. Oh, I guess a lot of uh, a lot of the enemies have mutants. So yeah, I guess it's sometimes just so those maps where uh, the zombies or well, mutants showed up. So it might not be super easy to find them sometimes. Maybe we don't need that many items down here. But yeah, there should be a bunch of them, but... Rise of the Mutant sounds like one where I played with mutants. I know, I think there was a mutant focus though. But yeah. Hello, the mighty titan is here. I did build the wonder, right? The... Uh, the Tremona? Yeah, there. Okay. Check the in. I mean, I could also do that. The there we go, we get a Tenatus. Yes. Target party? Uh, I didn't set a target party because I should have more than enough with the bottom places, but... Okay, maybe we want a few more here. Oh, I didn't replace this with walls. That's okay. That's a sin wall then. <laughs> yeah. That's okay too. The mighty titan is here. My machine is ready. Oh, there's a lot of zombies coming down here. To that one place. Snipers up here. We could actually flank the wave here. Let's go. Then he probably better was. Yeah, he was just closer to the north. To be honest, <laughs> that's the whole reason. Good thing I built that oil one. I definitely needed all these titans. Yeah, that's the like value of a good choke point. We don't really need much here and can hold two sides of waves easily. Like, all this we didn't even need. Oh, 
What do you think about having a normal map, but every time you can combine with a random challenge? Um, I mean, if the challenge is interesting, I guess. I think it's is in more. Maybe I'm wrong, but I personally would feel it would be interesting to have like one challenge and then do random maps until the challenge is beaten. Like when I did Rangers only or something. But I don't have really good challenge ideas to, um, lately that I haven't done already. And aren't just tedious to play. <laughs> like, no, I'm not gonna do no unit challenge. I that just as tedious. It's doable, people have done it. But I don't think it's fun to play. The sniper that was outside the wall still alive? No. I did uh, I did a chase command at some point during one of the earlier waves. And then he ran up here and tried to flank the wave solo. That was a bit optimistic on his part. Bob is safe? Yeah, sure, he's safe. In heaven. Triple oh zombies next. The problem with more zombies, I mean, triple, maybe triple still works, but even, so even double was already lagging on my PC at the start. Like, it doesn't look too bad on the video, but playing it, I always um, notice the delay when I, like, the first, like, 10, 15 days whenever I gave a command, to my rangers, it was like a slight. It felt like there was a delay. So I don't know if triple zombies is even feasible without it being too laggy. What is the 900% map? That's just a difficulty factor. 